I feel that with digital era, we can transform ourselves into a better and solving a lot of business issues. Based on your, your background working from, you know, research to founding uh, two startups uh, so far and currently is the uh, founding member for the uh, favorite uh, working on IoT a lot. How do you see digital agriculture for your own view of point? View of point? Uh, thank you very much, uh, Dr. Nodin, uh, for the kind introduction and this question regarding uh, digital agriculture, which is the main theme of the conference itself. Uh, I would was- I would look at the perspective of uh, the whole value chain of agriculture itself. Because we are talking about not only the farmers themselves, the supply side, uh, the, the, the supply side, but also on the demand side. And uh, if you look at the whole supply chain, it goes from the farmer themselves to the sellers and the one even who cooks at your house or at the restaurant. So if you look at the whole value chain, it is very vast and very long uh, agriculture chain. And also, we, we take a look at agriculture itself. It's not about plantation alone, but we have seen aquaculture itself. And we have seen like livestock, like what uh, Dr. Jeffrey on poultry farm just now. So it's a very interesting thing to see that how uh, technology like this can play a main role. So if, if you take a look at how I see that digital agriculture can play a big role is that we have been using manual physical tools for many, many years. And even now we are using that too. So I feel that with digital era, we can transform ourselves into a better and solving a lot of business issues. Uh, I did mention that earlier in yesterday's presentation about the seven M's of the business. So in any business, you just take a look at how digital agriculture can play that, you know, uh, play that, uh, solving the issues. About manpower themselves, you can uh, reduce the cost of manpower, uh, the productivity of the manpower itself. You look at the machines that you have been utilizing, you just use the tools to manage your, your machines. And if you look at the materials, the, the fertilizers, the, the all these materials, even your fruits, you need to maintain them. Even the methods, the processes that you are working on. With digital agriculture, you can reduce a lot of processes. You can trim down unnecessary resources. You look at the market. Now, instead of having local, you can even access to global. And the wonderful part is that it can create new revenue stream too or increase your sales, increase the yields. And finally, if you look at the way we talk about managing the data, all technology like this is collecting all data, either from the back-end system, from the IT system, or even from the IT sensors. And from that sensors data, you can make many meaningful decision-making process. That will help the management. So digital agriculture can can help in all of these the seven M's of the business, regardless whether you are the farmer or you're the logistic player or even you are the technology player who provide the services. That, that's how I see uh, digital agriculture play a role. You, you, you just take a look at whether the farmers have issues of manpower because now a lot of people see that agriculture is not very fancy thing, you know, people don't like agriculture, but using drones, uh, people are coming back to agriculture business, you know, they, they love to play like these toys coming back. So, uh, in fact, you have seen 300% increase of yields, 300% reduce of manpower using this technology. So, even manpower is a plays a big role. But I think one of the things also, we can reduce the, 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 the cost in terms of, and because a lot of now we are talking about wastage. Uh, most of the time, you 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 order things which you don't even know whether you know you can use it on time or you know at the rightly at the, the the time. Even at the restaurant, sometimes you order just now. What uh, one of the speaker had mentioned is a lot of wastage of food. In fact, eighty five percent of wastage because we are not having the enough data to to justify us. Uh, what to purchase, when to purchase, you know, what, uh, uh, where exactly that you want to supply the, your, 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 your goods and all that. So with that, with that kind of data that you can, you know, from digital information, the data that we have uh, extracted, that will definitely will help the farmers uh, by, you know, uh, how to supply their, their, their goods to the market. 